Hey guys, Jessica again. So as you're preparing for your skills testing, learning about IM injections, what your max dose is in each area, I wanted to help you kind of go over a few things and give you a few little tips that help me remember. And once again, they're a little weird, but that's how I operate. So just remember in our IM injection sites, we have vastus lateralis, the vastus gluteal, and then we also have the deltoid. So the deltoid that's up here um, on the shoulder, you go, you find your acromion process on the shoulder. You do two to three finger widths below and then you imagine your area in here. Now remember the deltoid is like a small triangle so you really have a close spot to give that injection to make sure you actually get it into the correct spot. For the vastus lateralis you find the knee or find the place where the leg bends. You put your hand there. Put your hand above the knee and then that space in between, you kind of go to that outer part, and that's the muscle, the VL, where you would do. For the VG, you're going to play, um, have like the patient standing or on their um, side. You're going to place your palm on the greater trochander of their hip. You're going to put your hands over the anterior iliac spine with the thumb pointing towards the pubis. And this is backwards for you, so sorry, you'd probably do it this way. Um, but you're going to spread your fingers over the iliac spine, and you're going to go between like the second and third finger for your injection site. Um, if it's any type of medication that needs to go into a deep IM or a well-developed muscle, you want to use that VG for reference. So um, max dosing in the deltoid should only be about one mil. Now the VL, fastest lateralis, and VG, you know what those are, I'm making them short, um, that's three mils. So for me to remember, for kids, that's for mostly adults. For kids, it's quite different. So for babies, they usually get a half mil, they're half size babies. Um, they can only go in the vastus lateralis. Now if you think about that, you should be able to remember, you know, most kids when they go in the doctor's office, they get the shot in their, their VL, in the side of their thigh. Um, Children under five, if you think you're five, you're going to be getting ready to go into the first grade next. So if you're five, you can have one mil for first grade, and you can be in the VL and the VG. So children under five, how many mils? One, because they're going into the first grade, and the sites are? Yeah, VL and VG. Now, children six to 12 years of old, if you're six, What's the next grade you're going to be going into? Well, you'll be getting ready to get into the second grade. So if you're six, you can have two mils in the VL and the VG. But now you can have a half to one mil in the deltoid. So I think of a mother lecturing her child saying, no deltoids till you're six. So to go back over that one more time, for adults in general, it's deltoid is one mil. The VL and VG are three mils. Now for infants, it's half a mil in the vastus lateralis VL. Children under five, they are going into the first grade, so they can have one mil in the VL and VG. Children six to 12 years of age, six, you're going and preparing for the second grade, so you're gonna get two mils in your VL and VG, and you can have a half to one mil in your deltoids, and no deltoids till you're six years old. So I hope this helps you when you are preparing to give those injections. It's a little scary at first, but practice makes perfect, and I hope you have a great day.